So we are headed to the Sierra Nevadas for Operation Golden Nugget. We got up real early this morning and got all ready. It looks like we're you know, a case of 20, 21,000 sheets. 21,000 sheets. I calculated like squares per day times the number of people and I think that's the right amount. Who wants to go shopping right now? We're going shopping. We're shopping. Veggie tray. We need a veggie tray if somebody wants to look for that. So we got the stuff we needed. Hopefully. How's that cart? I hope you don't you guys don't starve. I think we'll be okay. If not, there's blackberries there, I think. So 47 years ago, Ed drove his Suzuki J20 for the last time because he put it away for the winter and then that winter a rock slide came and trapped it from civilization. It's been there ever since. We're gonna go down and get it. We've got Ed, we've got Tucker, Trevor, we've got Paul from Fab Rats, we've got Eric, we've got Lizzie, and we've got Tom Tom. Ed, we're gonna need a weather report. Oh, well, it's clear today, no clouds, a little breezy, kind of cool, and uh, Hope we don't hit any snow. We'll make it. <laughs> Poor Tom was so excited for this trip he couldn't sleep. Poor little guy, he's tuckered out. So we made it back to civilization. You know how you can tell? Maverick! Oh yeah, Mavericks. <laughs> Sweet! I forgot my wallet. Why would you do that? So I didn't have to pay for anything? Huh? <laughs> huh? So we just got all fueled up in Reno. And we're gonna drive up over these Sierra Nevada mountains and they've already got snow on them. We may have picked a really bad week to come and get this thing. All right, last stop was at SPD Market. I don't know what that stands for, but we were here. Ed got his stuff. Now we're hitting a windy road and we'll go try to set tents up in the dark. So we're here at the point where the road starts to get really narrow. Ed's a little bit concerned about the size of, the, of our trucks to come down there. We're pulling trailers, both me and Paul. But since we're basically children, we're, we want to give it a try. <laughs> Good morning. So we got a lot going on this morning. We got quite the traffic jam here. Ed doesn't think there's been this many full-size rigs down here ever before. So where we're camping here is actually private property. We have the owner's permission, of course. Tom's here in the kitchen. He's gonna make us some grub. Good morning. What, what do we got on the menu? Breakfast burritos, so hag sausage, bacon. Those are the best kind of burritos to have for breakfast. Yeah, they're my favorite. This is Tom Tom's tent. There's Paul's tent. Trevor and Tucker are staying in that tent. I'm just sleeping in the back of my truck. I don't understand tents. So this is where Eric is staying. And 
I think Lizzie is still in the midst of her beauty sleep. So this is where Ed slept, is in the, the back of his truck. You got a weather report for us? It looks like a good day. No wind, clear sky. It's not that cold. And warm up today, and and uh, we'll go find that golden nugget and <laughs> get it on out of here. Get it out. So we're about an hour and a half away from cell phone reception, so we're completely off the grid. That's why I'm wearing my gridlessness hoodie. They would call it a toque, I think. Look how purple Lizzie is this morning. <laughs> we're from southern Utah, and we have trees, but we don't have Sierra Nevada trees. Like, quite literally, this tree right here We'd be like, well, that's a good sized tree. <laughs> this is our camp chef, and this is our camp chef. Oh, how are we going to tell us apart? The They're hat. both making bacon. The hat. Breakfast is ready. Not too shabby. Mm. I think it'll go pretty good. Uh, it'll be a little hard to move in some rocks, but if the Jeep will fit down the trail, I don't think it will. But if it don't, we can use the four wheeler to get it out, I think. Paul's been teasing me. He thinks that we're gonna take on some body damage and I'm not even disputing it, but we're gonna make this fun because I want Paul to guess where it's gonna happen. I'm gonna have him sign his name right there. Oh, I moved it up in farther. Do that. <laughs> See what's up river. The banana is wider than my arm span. <laughs> So here it is. If you remember the first video, like where we came and scoped this out, it was looking pretty narrow, but now that I've got the Jeep here, it's looking worse. <laughs> Keep coming. Good luck. Okay. Just stay right with the tree. Here's a, here is a visual of what's going to happen. We're rolling, 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 rock. Okay. We're getting there. smoking and what when they come up with this idea oh no i'll totally fit uh-huh all right what are we doing with this rock we're leaving it running it over yep i don't know i'm thinking maybe that rock needs to move too okay now I'll go passenger you're rubbing Let's um run the winch out to something over here and then yeah, back and suck it, it that way. way. Suck your winch in. Just let it pull you. There you go. Go suck for it. Suck it in some more. It'll roll with it. Like it'll roll yeah, anyway. it's doing it. Go suck for it. it. Keep going. Keep going. Don't let him hit the rope. Okay, hold up. Winch out. Yeah, go. We're gonna have to rig up again. I didn't expect to run into problems this quickly. You made it. 200 yards. Yeah, yeah, 200 yards. <laughs> you got how many miles? <laughs> I still wanna know what they were smoking. <laughs> yeah! Oh, I could have made that up by myself. Well, thanks. <laughs> Way to make me feel worthless, like you always do. Thanks. Okay, right there, drive. I used to ride my bike on this trail before we built this one. 
Oh yeah. The Rokon. Right. right on the edge, a, all the way down. Some, Had a good trail here. all the way. Go next tree. <laughs> I, I think I'm a, really at maximum angle right here. Do you feel like me yet? Yeah. Where are you moving that one to, Eric? Hey, who has an angle finder on their phone? I turned it so we don't have to do math. Oh, hey. Math anymore. Oh, we had a degree doing that too. There's a little little play there. A lot of people said that car keys really help see what the angle is. I'm going to show you the key in my ignition. Do you see it there? It's sticking out. Straight out almost. How's it holding yourself up? I'm barely staying here. <laughs> I'm gonna get my ex. <laughs> <laughs> You'll miss right there. Good thing is, it's warm now. Yeah, warm. It's I'm cold. overheated now. Yeah. Okay, you're good, Matt. Roll it in. Oh, that feels good. I'm sitting on the seat now instead of hanging on to it for dear life. Right there. Close as you can get without hitting it. You're good. You can have your thought. Doing it all today, man. So what we've got here is a trail that's narrower than the Jeep, in case you haven't been paying attention. And now the bank is gone. So instead of a wall and a wall I can't fit between, I've got a wall and nothing that I also can't fit between. Hubbub. Well, we think the banana is not going to. They made your banana about a foot and a half too wide. Can I go around the, the outside of it? No. Yes, I could. That's an idea. Yeah. I could literally go around the outside of this. I mean, it's not. It's not not scary. Okay, go back. Now, thank the driver still goes a little bit longer. Hard passages. Okay. Straighten it out. Go back, driver. All right, it's coming up. Go, driver. Go, keep going, driver. Keep coming. Okay, now go passengers. Hang on, don't come off there too fast. I promise you'll go over. Turn hard. Hard. Okay, Whoa. Whoa. so crazy I don't know I think we should do more trail prep on our way out yeah well, we know the hard spot now the whole thing yeah. it's wrong I'm, I'm getting out so I can walk around how come you're not walking straight up and down Ed's starting to second guess the fr his the friends he's chosen How's things going in your neck of the woods? Going good. Just, it's 
bearing trees. We're here. Yeah. Too bad Fred wasn't here. I He's know, cool, I dude. Wish he was here. We're there. Yep. How'd you do on that backside when you came around the tree? I don't know. I haven't seen it. How much damage have I sustained? Well, you guys made me a winner. Did I? That's not the right on my well, Okay, official hey, scores hey. aren't in yet. <laughs> okay. crawl this edge. Yeah, this is easy. We've gone way worse than this, me and you have. Oh yeah, I better No, I mean a, a rope for Ed to walk down. Really I'm here. saying jump him in it. We'll drive down this nice and slow. Down. Okay. okay, just can you see? Keep going. Go driver just a hair. Hold it straight right there. Just straight. Right there, hold it. Come off of there. Okay, hold it back right there. Cut it straight off. Straight off. ever been in here? Oh yeah, yeah. Only the military jeep and my Suzuki's been in here. <laughs> so Ed tells him earlier, he's always chowing down on something, he's heads off. This eating all day's gotta stop. <laughs> everybody across the river and then scout it on foot again <laughs> I think so we crossed right over there and we're driving over okay. so what the all those trees are hiding is the worst rock pile you've ever seen well first of all we need to see if we have a winner winner chicken dinner so 50 bucks if it crosses your name 20 bucks to whoever's closest Tom Tom Tom, Tom. Oh that yeah was, that was yeah. Look at all this. Yeah, I, think, there, that, I think Tom Tom, Tom is buying dinner. <laughs> buying dinner? I You're gonna I... be the rich one. <laughs> all right, I gotta pay up. Yep. Thanks for playing. Thank you. You're just killing it today. Yeah. Breaking Gambling. it in. Yeah, Breaking you just it add in. that to your list. We forgot yes. Gambling yes. man. Oh. Is, it, is it beautiful, Tucker? Mm -hmm. Our eye in the sky.
This is the road right here. This is going to get real difficult here. This is the rock side. So Paul brought us back on the four-wheeler to fix lunch. What are we having for lunch today? We're having chicken sandwiches. So we need to turn these into lunch. The birds are cooking. We've got a bunch of fruit. I wonder if we should chop up some of this fruit. We had a little accident with the cantaloupe, but nobody's going to know until they see the video. So they'll taste fine. <laughs> I'm contemplating my life decisions. <laughs> see if it moves this rock. Come just a little bit. we're moving it. Maybe we'll push it down and have a better. I know Tucker's gonna be editing this and he's gonna be like, what? I ate that! That was my piece! Your driver's tire needs to come and come right through here somewhere. Okay, cantaloupe is good to go. Not really. Yep. cameraman holy oh. smokes you're just doing everything uh, we don't even need anybody else here we just no. need tom tom jack of all trades <laughs> tom outdid himself last time he cooked me chicken it was terrible is that, is that like 20 years ago yeah <laughs> 25 years ago you have did you 25 like years <laughs> this is poison oak this is lunch this is lizzie <laughs> eating lunch over the poison oak this is Tucker. Nobody ever pointed it out to me. Reaching over the poison oak for his lunch. We're living dangerously. All day. All day. 40 feet till freedom. Right there. We have to fill the low side with material from the high side. So this used to be a road. That's how that J20 got up there, was it drove up there. It used to drive back and forth on this road. So Tom's a civil engineer now, too. What is it? Is that, what is that, Tom? I'm not a geologist. Oh, come on, Tom. All right, lunchtime's over. It looks like we're getting back at it. <laughs> That's how Matt threw out his back. doing a fine outstanding job today i want to commend you on your services it means a lot coming from you trip all i've got is a gopro battery <laughs> i'll get you something better later <laughs> we've got to clear this all out ingenious because how do you feel about that top. plane there's stuff in the way we're gonna make it not in the way and then they're gonna drive through it. Simple yet effective. I brought cantaloupe if anybody wants some. Whoop whoop! 
I can't elope. I'm married. I'm take it clear out. <laughs> it's all right. It just edited it out anyway. Oh, that was staying in because he's so proud of it. So Look at him. <laughs> all right. Is this what we're going to? Is this yep. right here? Yep. Come on. Yeah, it's almost no effort. Science. Science. Oh, my God. That's what he says. <laughs> Yeah. That got us somewhere, but almost nowhere. Has anybody else caught Tom Tom humming? I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. He's also a singer? We'll use it for traction. You grunt, it will go. I try to knock you out anymore. That's the old me. Oh, wow, I felt that. These are quite fresh. Yep. I'm going to drill it and break it up in little pieces. I ought to drill it where it's at. It don't matter here. That's the way that serpentine is. There's only so many people that can run a drill and a hammer, so instead of standing here all day, we're gonna go up, cut the little bit of trail we gotta cut into the Suzuki, and then when they get this done, we'll be ready to go. We did it. This is the first time a motorized vehicle has been on this road in 47 years. Oh man. 47 years ago was the last time you drove it. You were Paul's age. <laughs> That's crazy. So you said that you you were you were cleaning up the camp and you gave your mom a ride out. Yeah. And then you brought it back and parked it, walked out, and then uh, came back the next year and the rock slide had cut off access. So here it sat. So we're gonna wait till tomorrow to pull it out. It's getting dark, everybody's tired. We've been making mistakes all day, but you make more mistakes when you're tired. For sure. <laughs> 